and ring. I'm waiting for my student and that's what the class looks like. So she was there in the morning but then she logged out so I think her mom did that and we have three minutes to for class to start. So I'm waiting. So we have to wear like an orange shirt. Nobody said anything about the PJs. Morning guys and we are off to school and my son is limping for some weird reason. I don't know why. Why are you limping, Aram? He's like limping like an old grandpa. I'm just like, what's wrong with you? He's like, my leg hurts. I'm like, you probably slept on it wrong. But he's he's like a little old grandpa, a four-year-old grandpa. Look at him. Little four-year-old grandpa. I love you. <laughs> Silly. <laughs> Uh, all right, guys. Vlogmas day two. Bring it on. And look at this weather. Look at this, guys. It's crazy, man. I don't. Honestly, I highly dislike rain and fogginess and all that stuff. It just really tampers with my mood. Not too much, but you know, it's really it's it is a little tampering. There's my little champ. Look at that awesome, precious angel cakes. I can't wait to be Oh, 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 oh. Cold, I know, puppy. The car's warming up, chiquito. Um, so today, I am going to work in Uber. I know yesterday I said I was going to work in Uber, but I ended up <clears throat> doing some other errands and stuff that I had to do. But today, I will be working in Uber. And great news, I got accepted into Liberty University. Woo woo! Liberty University, guys. So I'll be starting classes January 22nd, and it's for my Master of Arts in Theology, my Master of Arts in Theological Studies. I am super stoked. Aren't you happy that mommy's going back to school? <gasps> Yay! Uh, my goal and my dream is to become a university professor. And what better thing to teach than the Word of God? So, all right guys, we'll see you in a bit because we're warming up the car, but we are super late. So, see you guys in a bit. Say bye, Papa. Bye. Say see you soon. Bye. All right. Here at McDonald's, I'm about to pick up an order. It was my first order this morning. So, I'm about to show you guys for the first time um, an Uber delivery. So, I always promise you, but I never show. I'm just trying to be discreet about it, guys. You know, I don't want to like pop a camera on someone's face like, here's your order, sir. You know, and then they're <laughs> like, why are you recording my face, homie? So, here we go. All right, thank you. Okay, thanks. All right, guys, did you get that? Because I was trying to be as slick as possible. On my way to drop this stuff off, guys, and see you guys in a bit. Was this guy hot? Lord forgive me, Lord forgive me, but this guy was hot. <laughs> he was like, how you doing? I was like, how you doing? Good morning. Yeah. And then I gave him his food and I was like, OMG. I don't know, like seriously, this guy was hot. This guy was hot, I gotta admit. <laughs> 
<laughs> Why did I get his number? No. <laughs> All right, guys, I'll see you later. I gotta cool down a little bit over here. Guys, I had a super rough day today. I'm not even gonna play with you. I stopped at after that delivery recording because everything went downhill from there. I'm not even joking with you guys. It was just, it was like everyone was demon possessed or something. I don't even know what was happening. It was so crazy. Yes, baby. Oh, I know, mi amor. I'll let you borrow my phone, okay? Hey, mi amor hermoso. And, um, okay, so I had to go print out some stuff, and I had to go fax some stuff, and as soon as I got to Kinko's, Kinko's is the equivalent of uh, Staples, where, you know, I don't have a printer, so you go to Kinko's to print some stuff out. Yeah. And so, um, my my debit card wasn't being taken so I went up to the lady hesitantly because I know that Kinko's it's like they work to stand there and like because it's a self-service place so they they really give you the bad face like the poop face when you come up to them like what do you want and I'm like I mean they don't say that but she was like hi can I help you and I was like yeah my debit card isn't uh, being taken anywhere and she's like maybe it's your bank I'm like ma'am I just called my bank. It's not my bank. It's just like, well, you need to call them again. I'm like, can you just do something? Please. She wouldn't. She wouldn't. So I had to go to physically to an ATM, take out $20, change it, come back, put some money in a card that they offer, and do it that way. And then it's just so much stuff. I'm not even joking guys, it was like so much stuff with my ex-husband and it's not even a vlogmas today man, I was just, I literally spent half my day crying in the car. Um, yeah, so if some of you could just pray for us and that everything goes well, um, you know, I just, I know it's a lot of personal stuff but you know, I've been seeing, I started, I, I got a lawyer and so I'm just kind of going back and forth with that and then like three applications got rejected not work applications but like stuff um, stuff that I'm applying for and one thing is missing and the other piece is missing and then like it's got rejected and then the lady on the phone with customer service when I called uh, the New York I called New York City they were like well we were waiting for your paperwork I'm like could somebody have told me and it was her arrogance she was like well I'm telling you now I was like Lord, what is everybody on? Did everybody smoke a joint at the same time? What is going on today? Like nobody wanted to help me. It was just so agonizing and dramatic. Sorry guys, this is how I end my vlogmas. <laughs> so we've been home um, and now my son and I are just chilling, relaxing and the most important thing is that I am home with my son and that is the most important thing for me because some people never make it home so we got to be really positive about it, right? So. This is the end of my Vlogmas day two. Sorry I didn't give you more, you know, shows. You know, I just, it's, it was just crazy, guys. I'm not even joking with you, it was crazy. Um, uh, but the good news is that I ended it with applying for the school district, for the school, for the district. I'm hoping that I can, um, there's an open position for an ESL teacher in Gwinnett County Schools, which is where I reside. So. Oh my goodness, I'm like, like, I just finished the questionnaire. It's crazy dramatic how many questions and like everything that they ask you for, references, and of course you're working for the state, you know? So, but I really want to, I really need to have a stable position now I need, as a teacher. That's what I do, so I just need to, you know, I can't rely on anything or anyone, you know, especially crazy men, crazy people like my ex-husband. So, just, it's just a lot of stuff, guys. It's like he, it's like he just gets pleasure out of making me cry. Like, he gets physical pleasure out of making me cry. It's just not even, I don't even understand that. I think it's a psychopathic tendency. I'm pretty sure it is. Um, anyway, so guys, that's it. I have another class tomorrow morning and that's it for my vlogmas. I'll end it with jingle bells to end it on a good note. Alright, I'll see you guys later. Bye.